Hello and welcome everyone. I'm Nick. Let's go to you our journeys. Episode 15, Note on the Pillow. What are we waiting for, gorgeous? I, uh, there's no escape this time. What's with that look? What's up? I remembered my ex. Let's dance, Ralph. Put on some music and let's dance. There's nothing I'd like more than to have your body pressed against mine. Get ready to see all my moves, handsome. That's not the type of dance that I had in mind. Yeah, me too, actually. Finally, he drank from his cup. Let's dance until he falls asleep. That works fast. So, what happened? Ralph is asleep. I took him to his bed. It's time to go through his apartment and see what we can find. But first, I'll write a note for Ralph so he sees it tomorrow. Sounds good. What are you going to write? I had to go. You were great, Ralph. He'll say that he was great. He's so faint that he won't have any doubts about what happened. So great. Babe, you're here. I needed you by my side. Last night with Ralph, I was dying to see you too. I'd stay here with you, but I need to go and meet with the judge. Some things just can't wait. If you only knew what I went through last night, I had a date with Ralph to lure him into the trap. He took me back to his place and I gave him a sleeping pill. That's risky, babe. Did it work? He fell fast asleep and I could investigate the place. And I found a bunch of falsified deeds. I'm very proud of you, but you seem a little worried. Are you sure that the situation with Ralph is under control? Don't worry, I can handle it. I trust you, that's all I needed to hear. I'm going to see Celestine and then we'll go together to the judge. I don't want to be away from you for another minute. Thanks babe, Celestine is upstairs with Sarah, the mother. Go and give her a hug, she missed you a lot. But first, I want to kiss you. You did a good job, Katie. Those falsified deeds will be a great help. I hope so. I risk a lot to get them. Katie is being so brave, is he? I hope that everything goes well. The case is pretty strong. We have proof of what they did to you and Kevin's sister. And the recordings of Vera at the hotel. Plus, I have the photos of Vera going to see the properties. I'm going to involve the Federal Investigation Department. Are you prepared to continue with the plan? Plan? What plan? Yeah, what plan? We have to find someone to be the bait. Like a fake buyer. That's the idea, but it could take a while to get it through legal channels. I can't wait! Don't worry, I know who can be the bait. You look like you've been hit by a truck. Do you feel okay? It is not a truck. I feel a bit dizzy. I called you several times this morning. I was sleeping. I was out like a light. I don't know why. What's that note doing here? You were amazing, handsome. I miss you already. Bye. Wow, now I really am confused. You drank too much and forgot what happened? Hmm, let's talk about something else. Okay, we need to finalize the sale of the property that we chose. If we don't do it now, we run the risk of everything going cold. We'll do it this week, I promise. You'd better, we don't want to miss this opportunity. I already told you, we would stop bothering me. Now, I need to go to the office and deal with someone. You mean Katie? Good morning, Kevin. 
We need to talk right now. Did something happen? Not a good morning. Good morning, Christine. Do you have a second? We need to talk. Stay with Kevin. Go with Wanda. Yes, of course. Raf asked to see you as soon as you arrive. Is something wrong? You tell me. He's in terrible mood because of you last night. I wanted to talk to you. I woke up very confused today and you weren't there. Can you explain to me what happened? I don't know what to say. I'll convince him. Yeah, you were great, Ralph. Of course, I'll tell you exactly what happened last night. We danced and had a couple of glasses. We had a great time. Maybe we drank a bit too much, but it was part of the fun. Then you fell asleep and I left. How embarrassing, I failed you. Not at all, last night was really special for me. We could do it again, don't you think? Go to second base or third base? Of course, my schedule is hard, but we'll find a way. Harder than the boss, huh? Your schedule? Thanks for coming so quickly. We're intrigued. What's going on? There's something important that we want to ask you. Vera and Ralph are selling a house through a scam. And we need a couple to pretend to be interested in buying it. Us? Yes, so the judge and the federal police can trap them in Fragranti. We'll fill up everything and follow the money from the moment it's deposited. Where are we going to get the money? That doesn't matter. Wait, that matters. Whose money is that? Whether it's thousands or millions of dollars, what's important is the scam. Are you going to help us? You can count on me. Anything to help, my friend. I love you guys a lot, but I don't know if I can do this. Good choice. Emily, me. Let's just let Emily do her thing. Adam and Katie are our best friends. They're family. And I'll do anything for family. They're like family to me too. I understand that you're nervous. But we'll do this together, Anton. We have to support one another in everything. You're right. I'm sorry. Together, we can do anything. You can count on me too. It's what friends are for. What are we waiting for then? Let's get to work. Hello, who is this? I'm Vera. I received your online message about the property. Yes, of course. It's a beautiful house. I loved it. As you see, it's a great price. The owner needs to sell it as soon as possible. We should arrange a visit then. My husband and I are very interested. I can show it to you whenever you want. Just let me know. Tomorrow afternoon then? Perfect, I'll see you there with your husband. Get ready to see the house of your dreams. I'm ready, thank you. Well done, Emily. They're doing the same thing they did with me in Paris. They have the same modus operandi, but now we're ready. The first step is done. We recorded the conversation. Don't lose it. Excellent. There's a way to go, but we're on a good path. Raf and Vera, get ready. We're coming for you. Do you know who's coming to spend the day with you? Not mommy and daddy, Grandpa Marvin. Yay, yay. Promise me you'll be good. I want to play with Grandpa, not mommy and daddy. Did somebody say Grandpa? Grandpa? Ready to play all afternoon. Yes, I'll get my toys. Here, this was on the door. It's an eviction notice. We have to leave. Yes, forget the house. You've been warned. Thank you for watching. Have a wonderful day. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And see you guys on our next journeys.